I am Dr. Sharda Jain. Welcome to our YouTube channel, Life Care Center, Sahi Upchar. Today I am going to talk on daycare hysterectomy. Hysterectomy is the most common non-pregnancy related major surgery performed on a woman today. This surgical procedure removes the, the uterus, the cervix, and in some conditions, the fallopian tube and the ovaries are also removed. Now it has become a policy that whenever the ovaries are retained, the fallopian tubes are also removed because that's a source of future ovarian malignancy. The experts and the elders like us feel, if technically feasible, Vaginal approach is preferable based on the reported benefits of the shorter hospitalization, fewer complications, lesser pain, lower cost, and early discharge. Despite of these benefits, the vaginal hysterectomy seems to be underutilized and amounts to only 10% these days because of many reasons. The prolapse of uterus incidence has come down tremendously because of the better labor standard of care. Beside this lack of descent, big uterus, previous cesarean section, lack of training and expertise, and availability of high technical gadgets like laparoscopy and robotic surgeries are few of the reasons why the vaginal hysterectomy is going down. Foxy the American College of Obstetrician Gynecologists are recommending that vaginal hysterectomy should be the approach of choice wherever feasible. Laparoscopic hysterectomy is preferable alternative to open abdominal hysterectomy provided the doctors are fully trained and have reasonable expertise in whom the vaginal hysterectomy is not indicated or feasible. As a surgeon, I can only say that the gynecologist should account for clinical factors to determine the best route of hysterectomy for her patients and her expertise. She should not be dependent on other people, especially the surgeons. Now better electro-surgical bipolar vessel sealing systems are available, which can seal the blood vessels up to 7 millimeter in diameter. By using these equipments, technique becomes easier, less bloody, shorten the operation time, and less post-operative pain. So the recommendations are to the younger colleagues are that a vaginal hysterectomy is art should be learned and should be the approach of choice wherever feasible because of the better outcomes and cost effectiveness for your patients.